Well, for the first time in the Commonwealth history, Pennsylvania has allocated state funding to support public defenders, and now advisors are processing how to spend that money. But how far will seven and a half million dollars go? WNY's Kara Jeffers is in Harrisburg with more tonight. For the first time in its history, Pennsylvania is sending state support to local public defenders, made possible by a bill Governor Josh Shapiro signed in December. This week, the Indigent Defense Advisory Committee met for the first time to discuss how to spend their new $7.5 million. Um, we heard about the need for support staff, uh, the way that in many offices there are no social workers, no investigators, no paralegals. Before that bill was signed, local counties were responsible for all defense attorney expenses and operations. Some counties could afford the cost, others couldn't. Sarah Jacobson, chair of the advisory committee, described a recent visit to one public defender's office. She had one part-time lawyer working with her. She told me that her caseload, their caseload was something between 550 to 600 cases. That's 550 to 600 people. Pennsylvania counties spend roughly $125 million on indigent defense, averaging $9.67 per case. The national average is $19.82. The organization Sixth Amendment Center says that how money is spent is equally important to having money. A lot of states have had success tying that money to standards. Governor Shapiro recognized that the committee and funding is just the first step. We need to do more because the need is great. In Harrisburg, Kara Jeffers.